Hello guys and welcome back to the Kotlin tutorial. In this video we are going to install the latest version of IntelliJ IDEA ID. What we need to do is click on your favorite browser. In the search section search IntelliJ IDEA for Windows. Click on the first link. And here we can see the three version for Windows, Mac OS and Linux are available in here. But we are installing for Windows. Click on Windows. Scroll down. This is the ultimate version of IntelliJ ID. You can, it will be paid. You cannot download that for now. We, we don't need that. When you scroll down, only click on this download button. So after download is completed, you can click on it. It will take some time. Okay. So Windows is asking for permission. You can give. Uh, you can click on yes. Click on next. In here, you can browse the orders uh, where you want to install the folder and everything is here. You can click on that. So the required spaces in here, 2.7 GB and uh, as label as both of them are mentioned in here. So click on next. So in here, it is by default selected. Okay, in here you can select whatever you want for which language you want to select that. I'll select for community version and add the icon open the folder uh, directly all of them I need Java okay I'll select that uh, for Kotlin as well I don't need for them for now click on next in here leave it as default click on install as you can see we have a shortcut of a shortcut icon of IntelliJ ID in, on our uh, window so it will take some time so the installation is successfully completed now what you need to do is click on reboot it will restart your PC see you after restarting your PC click on finish now after rebooting click on IntelliJ icon you can skip this importing this is the interface of intellij id so now we are going to run a simple hello world program using kotlin, la kotlin language at the first we are clicking on new project and here what you need to do is you can select the language that you want as we running the Kotlin program I am clicking on Kotlin and if you don't have GDK I have already installed my GDK so you can install the latest version of GDK you can click on that and select the latest version of GDK name your project hello world You are going to run the hello world program there is nothing to do more you can click on create it will create the select this window this is a default template by kotlin and intellij id that it is making easy for you to run your programs by default a code is there that you would be easy for you to understand it is all of them only the part that we are requiring them you can leave them which would be a main function in here we can print a hello world program 
print inside double code you can write hello hello world as we know we don't need to put a semicolon or anything else press on run button or the on the top of our bar take some time to run our program and show it in console so in console you can check that it is hello world is written in here so we can six successfully run our first program hello world in IntelliJ idea id thank you for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe see you in the next one